Sorry you had to see that. You know Bonnie can have a flair for the dramatic. Is that what that was? I assumed it was sarcasm. Usually she just yells at me. Yeah, well, circumstances are... I know everyone's excited about the supply drop, but no crowding this time. I see anyone near the inventory out of turn. I'm docking his next paycheck for time loss. Hello? Anybody home? Must be the new Jeanette. I guess. Call me Jim. Jim, outstanding. Welcome to EDN3, Jim. The E stands for extreme. Still working on the rest. That's great, kid. You want to point me in the direction of your boss? Oh, uh, Mr. Braddock? I think you'd have seen him already, but yeah. No, I mean the lead tech for this bay. I think they said her name was Gail. <laughs> oh, right. Yeah. That's kind of me. I know, I know, I hear it all the time. Girl's name, shouldn't I be off looking for a date for junior prom? Dude, I understand you're concerned. But don't worry about a thing. I am totally getting college credit for this gig. I'm kidding, I'm, I'm kidding. Not in the mood, I read you. Listen, kid, Gail. How about we do the get to know you as while we work on putting my rig together? Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, are you serious? Uh, yeah, it was shipped ahead in pieces. <laughs> now that I'm here, we can build it. Um, the thing is, I kind of put it together last week. Again. It's a nice solid rig you got. Pretty intuitive design. It was no trouble. I had fun with it, really. All the diagnostics checked out. In fact, I just got done with the finishing touches. What finishing touches? Threw on some spring-loaded Kerner retractors. Jeanette said they always came in handy when the heat was on, which happens more often than you think on an ice planet. Get it? <laughs> ice planet? Because the heat... Kid. Went... Listen to me and listen close. I got three things in the world. My wife, my son, and this rig. Guess which one I'm counting on to take care of the other two? You follow? That is my whole nest egg. I built it myself. I know every gear, every circuit, and I can't have her breaking down on me because some intern needed to show off. Can I just say two quick things? Please. Okay, first, you can't really say in the world anymore, because you're on another planet. Sorry, just pet peeve. And? And secondly, okay, it's your show, Jim. I'm just here to help out. Give it a test drive whenever you feel like it, and if it ain't ship shape, break it all down by morning. Deal? I promise you won't be sorry. Let go of my hand. <laughs> 